Hey, I'm Bob. Been totally blind since birth, and I'm into Star Wars. Going to be taking a look at an action figure from the 30th anniversary collection, more specifically, the Ralph McQuarrie concept art signature series of action figures. So the FET unboxing didn't turn out quite the way uh, we wanted it to, so I was told I needed to uh, redo him. I can still post the unboxing if you want, but yeah, this is FET fresh out of his box as he was drawn by Ralph McQuarrie in the very beginning. I love this guy's suit quite a bit. So if we ever get a Jodo cast in Star Wars canon, that would be interesting if he would actually wear a suit that would look a bit similar to this. I know cast was supposed to be a knockoff Boba Fett in the, uh, in the Legends continuity. Uh, competing with Boba, wore a suit of Mandalorian armor that looked quite a bit like his. But uh, I like this look. And I'd love to see a Jodo cast that would look something like this. So um, he has a flame projectile or a flame effect that's coming out of his left gauntlet. And let's turn concept Boba around so you can see his right side so he's got a blaster there in his right hand right there and he's wearing a backpack although it doesn't look like a rocket pack to me it looks more like a run-of-the-mill backpack that you might keep extra weapons in don't really see a, uh, a a rocket motif there going on in the backpack at all so we're gonna lower his arms to his sides and I will attempt to show you the gut buster gun sticking out of his belly so he's got a little door that opens around his uh, his tummy And he has a little blaster sticking to the door. Yes, Luke Skywalker will never be able to stop my gut buster gun. <laughs> See, Concept Boba doesn't have a voice yet. So, you know. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else can we do with this guy? We'll close this little door. If you want, you can actually uh, pull Boba apart at the waist. I don't know why you can do that. Maybe we won't do that, though. I think sometimes that door has a tendency to, to come right off. But for some reason, yeah, you can um, detach Boba's pair of legs. And so you have him split in two. As if he were half droid or something, or all droid. Nah. I know that's not how it goes, but um, pretty nifty action figure. I'm going to detach his little flame effect piece. Really awesome that we got one of those. And so he's got an alternate portrait. I'm not sure if the one attached to him, this very familiar looking T-Visor, is uh, Macquarie's design. I would think that it probably is, because it makes sense that he came out of the package wearing the uh, Macquarie portrait but he also comes with an alternate head sculpt and I suppose this one is the Joe Johnston head sculpt would make sense that that would be in the package right beside him here and I'm going to try to show him all right let's show that new head sculpt here I like this helmet too because it looks a bit more Vader-ish in the front with a triangular faceplate, little points that jut off of the bottom of the helmet, the bottom of the, the front of the helmet there. Even the way the sides of the of the mask look reminds me of uh, Vader's helmet there. And of course on this uh, version of the the helmet you have the 
the rangefinder there on the on the left side. And the way that the the visor looks on the front here uh, makes me think of our clone troopers, our clone commanders, those guys that would you know have the visors that would come down in the front of their of their helmets. Very very familiar looking a visor to me there. The way that looks in the front, it really reminds me of uh, something you'd see a clone trooper sporting during the Clone Wars. That's pretty cool. Ah, uh, let's see. So I'm wondering if Boba might be wearing rocket boots, similar to Cad Bane's. Looks like he is. But I could be mistaken. Because I don't know much about uh, this, this concept version of him. Um, all the bells and whistles of his armor. Like I said, though, if, if they ever introduced Jodo Cast into Star Wars canon, I'd love him to wear a suit like this. You know, a white uh, set of armor here. I mean, he'd be Boba Fett-esque, but not, not as much of a, uh, a knockoff as he was in Legends. I'd love him to have a different suit, maybe some different weapons, things like that. Still a, a very menacing character if we ever did get a Jodo Cast, but... Yeah, he should. I think he should, you know, look a bit different from Boba. Unless, you know, they're going to go with, oh, Boba's being framed for things he didn't do in uh, in canon. That would be cool either way, though. I almost called him Jodo Cass more than once because uh, I am I really like th that character from uh, from Legends, what I read about him. So, yeah, I guess that'll do for concept Boba. And I'll hear you guys in the next Star Wars video. I'm thinking about posting the unboxing. Uh, maybe. We'll see. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe not. Just kind of cool to, uh, to be able to unbox this stuff and take a look at it the first time. Even if it uh, didn't turn out that well, I think it would be fun to uh, you know, take, a, take a look at that video at some point. So, till next time, may the Force be with you.